you you are very good hi good evening good evening yes. how are you fine fine very good All right, so how are you guys? I'm fine, Ansel. Oh, really? Why? Why, Jose Arturo? For, for start the class. Oh, okay. You want to start the class right now. <laughs> That's good. So how was your day? Um and I had to drive into vehicular traffic. Oh, that's so bad. Very stressing, right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, and you, Jasmine, how was your day? Thank you, sir. In this afternoon, I was going to work in, in Platform. And in this moment, I am in 2.8. All right. That's nice. Pretty good. You're getting close to section three. That's nice. We're reaching the goal. Excellent, Jasmine. And Mauricio, how are you, Mauricio? Fine, teacher, fine. Thank Very good. For asking me. Very good. How was your day? Um, busy. Okay. Uh, busy? Mm -hmm. Very busy. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, busy. Okay, yeah. yeah. I can imagine. Este... Mm -hmm. Teacher, I have a question. I received a message, message in, in WhatsApp um, que, que había sido invitado a, a una reunión para este día, pero no, no sé, ¿verdad? No, no. Para hoy, que era de, de inducción, como la que tuvimos hace dos, tres semanas, ¿verdad? Okay. Que había sido aceptado en el curso de inglés, decía, pero uh -huh. hago caso omiso, ¿verdad? Sí, exactamente. Yo mañana voy a preguntar de todos modos para que, si acaso se ha mezclado con alguna listita por ahí nueva, pues para que sepamos que ya está. Pero creo que no, no había ningún problema, ¿ok? Ok, okay. y te recibí otro mensaje. Uh -huh. de que este tenía que ir en la plataforma, ¿verdad? Y me pedía que ya tuviera la... Y, y ya las tengo eh, hechas. No sé si se debe a que yo cambié mi correo electrónico en la plataforma. No sé si ahí habrá habido alguna confusión. Perdón. Yo les contesté igual y, y les puse un screenshot de la, de, de, la, de la sección donde iba, pero al final no me contestaron. Ah, ok. Eh, sí, en todo caso, yo igual mañana voy a reportar eh, estos casos. Y si usted ya les escribió, pues nada más es de tener un poquito de paciencia, porque ahí los que se encargan de la cuestión técnica, pues si pasan un poquitín ocupado, ¿verdad? Con tanta cuestión que chequear y todo eso. Entonces, por eso a lo mejor no alcanzaron a ver su caso en este día. 
pero me imagino que mañana le estarían respondiendo. Good evening. Uh -huh. good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you, Karen? Thank you. All right, very good. How was your day? Yeah, it's fine. Thank you. Very nice. Did you have any time to work in the platform? Uh, I, I finished the platform uh, last week. Oh, you're done. Yes, I think you had told me. Okay, great. Did you get your, did you yes. get your uh -huh. diploma? Well. No sé si puedo descargar el diploma, Karen. No, I still not. Um, no, okay. All right, so I think we just have to wait, maybe this week or something. No, it's still not. Perdón, Karen, es que maybe. le escucho uh -huh. entrecortado también, no sé si será mi conexión o qué. Pero sí, yo creo que eh, no. a lo mejor al final de esta semana. Yo creo que es la algo... mía. <ríe> sí, no sé cuál de las dos. Pero sí, eh, me imagino yo que al final de esta semana ya estaríamos eh, completas con eso del diploma. De igual forma, yo mañana voy a, a reportar eso porque hay varios alumnos que me han comentado al respecto. Entonces sí voy a, a decirle a los encargados para que podamos ver cuándo van a estar disponibles y de qué forma lo vamos a, a obtener, ¿ok? Ok, ok. Hi, Selenia, how are you? Hi, thank you. Excellent. How was your day? I'm working and doing home work. Okay, kind of busy, I imagine. Yeah. All right, that's nice. Um, did you have any time to work in the platform? Selenia, did you have any time to work in the platform? Okay, sorry, Selene, I cannot hear you. Okay, Hello? good. Ahora sí. Exxon eh, 2.10. Okay, 2.10. All right, that's nice, keep going. Pretty really good. Good evening, Lorena. Well, so Lorena, we cannot hear you again. <laughs> Let's see, hi, Carla, how are you? Hello, teacher. Thank you. Very good. Great. Thank you. That's nice. I'm doing well. Thanks. So, how was your day? I'm in work. So, in the house. Okay. That's good. Did you have any time to work in the platform? A little bit. Yes. Okay. Sorry? Did you have any time to work in the platform? It, today, no. Okay. Uh, in this moment, yes. Next class. All right. That's fine. Very good. Hi, Roberto. Good evening. 
Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Fine, teacher. And you? Great. Thank you. Did you have any time to work in the platform today, Roberto? Yes, teacher. I am Tyson. Okay. Right. Pretty good. Hi, Anna Ruth. Good evening. How are you? Um, guys, can you hear me? No sé si me pueden escuchar, chicos. I think I'm having trouble with my connection. Hi there, can you hear me? Hola, se me cerró la sesión. No sé, creo que la conexión está un poquito débil or something. So if in any case you cannot hear me or maybe if something is not working, please let me know. Si de pronto se me escucha entrecortado o tenemos algún inconveniente, por favor eh, me dicen o me escriben en el chat para que, para que podamos tenerlo en cuenta, ¿ok? Sí, está bien. All right, thank you. So let's see. Um, we are going to start with our class by remembering what we studied yesterday about the imperatives. So tell me, please, what do you remember? Be quiet. Okay, that's an example. Be quiet. Mm -hmm. Any other thing that you remember about the imperatives? Don't. We use don't no, no. for the negatives. Yes, Arturo, can you repeat that, please? No smoke. No smoking, okay. Or don't smoke. Very good. Any other thing that you remember? Don't work too hard. Don't work too hard. Okay. Take your pills. Take your pills. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So I see you remember some of the examples. And remember that we use the infinitive or the base form without the two. And there is no subject in the imperatives like the examples we saw yesterday. And also for the negatives, we use do not or don't as you did in the examples. And we can also add please if we want to sound more polite. Okay, so now in order to put this into practice, we are going to do some work. I'm going to send you to breakout rooms for you to work in groups and you are going to have to write some rules for the following places. So here we have the zoo, the school, the movie theater, the museum, and the park. We are going to make three affirmative rules and three negative rules for each of the places. A cada grupo le voy a asignar un lugar y vamos a escribir tres reglas afirmativas y tres negativas. So let's see, let me make the groups. Okay, so that would be room number one, Jasmine, Jose Arturo, and Carla. You, you make some rules for the zoo, okay? Rule number two, Laura and Roberto. You make rules for the school. Room three, that will be Carla, Giselle, and Lorena. You work with the movie theater. Room four, Ana Ruth and Selenia. You work with the museum. And the last one, room five, that is Karen and Nestor Mauricio. You work with the park, okay? So you make three affirmative rules and three negative rules for each of the places. 
Okay, any questions? No questions? All right, so just no accept question. the invitations, please. positivas. Okay. Quizás entre las negativas, una de las principales podría ser que no le den no le den a los animales. Uh -huh. Sería done. Do not. Do not. Don't eat. Mm. ¿No? Don't eat, no. no. Don't give, don't, don't not give uh, meals or foods to the animals. Don't give food to the animals? Well, uh, guys. Then, then, un segundito, solo voy por eso. Okay, there's uh -huh. also this word feed. For giving food to the animals, you can also say don't feed the animals. Tenemos esa palabra okay. feed que significa alimentar. Entonces, don't feed the animals. No alimente a los animales o no les dé comida, right? Okay. Uh, feed sería F-E-E-D. Okay. Uh, -E 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 It's double oh, okay. E. Mm -hmm. Don't feed the animals. Don't feed the animals. Okay. Eh, teacher, ¿cuán, eh, ¿cuántas rulers? Um, it's three affirmative rules and three negative ones. Six in total. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Any other questions? Do not feel the only most. Okay, see you in a moment. Uh, don't. Don't, don't go, don't go to school. Yo creo que ya las tenemos, pero es que esta última no me convence. Pick up your books, recojan sus cuadernos. Sí. Yo creo que sí. Uh, no, es uh, no es trash, no botar basura. Don't, don't ah, esa sería positiva. Yo siento la siento positiva, ¿no? Oh, no. <risa> um, es que es positiva, pero está escrita en negativo. Es negativo, ya. Yeah. Any questions? Don't, don't, um, don't strive sería um, negative um, eh, o a posit positive, teacher. Perdón, don't no le... Don't... Trash. What do you mean? Trash. Oh, basura? Trash? Esta basura? Sí, ya, ya. Sí, yes. Okay, so that would be don't throw trash. Don't throw trash. Don't throw trash. Mm -hmm. No botar basura. Yeah, Sería negativa. Um, En ese caso, sí, pero también podríamos ponerla como put the yeah. trash. También podríamos decir put the trash put, in the put, trash put bin. Put the trash and the trash, uh, yeah. And then, Ponga la basura en el basurero. Yeah, right? but the trash. Pick up, pick up your books, puede ser positivo. Yes. Recoger sus libros, or maybe if you want to make it a general rule, um, probably you can say take care of your 
of your stuff. No olvidar. Or of your things. Take care of your things. Um, cuide sus cosas. No olvide, no olvide sus, sus libros. Don't forget your books. Uh -huh, don't forget. Mm -hmm. Hi, Lorena and Carla. How are you doing? Hi, este, creo que Laura tiene problemas con. Ah, sí, sí, me comentó. Con micrófono, así que estaba haciendo por el chat. Ok, that's good. Estaba haciendo por el chat. Tengo una pregunta. Tell me. Este, en este caso, podría ser keep silent para, para hacer entender que deben permanecer en silencio. O tiene que ser be quiet. O puede ser cualquiera de las dos. Cualquiera de las dos. Se puede utilizar keep silent. Or also be quiet. Mm -hmm. Y ese, yo agregué una. Pero en este caso sería más como, ah, como de opinión. Que es no children alone. No sé si se pronuncia. Allowed. Ok. No children are allowed. Sí. Sí se puede utilizar como regla, uh -huh. excepto que ahí no estaríamos utilizando el imperativo, pero sí. Sí es una uh -huh. forma de, de decir uh -huh. una regla. Uh -huh. Y también es el Lorena, perdón, puso don't smoke. Don't smoke. Yes, that's a good one. Y también do not eat or drink, pero siento que en este caso... El, eh, no entraría mucho porque en el cine se puede comer lo que no se puede es entrar comida de, de fuera ¿verdad? sería uh -huh. no, don't enter food um, don't bring food from outside maybe don't bring food from outside no traiga comida de afuera don't bring food from outside Okay. All right. Any other question? No, solamente. Gracias. Okay. All right. See you in a moment. Um. Well, Lorena, in that case, um, when we say movie theater, we refer to the cinema. Eh, cuando decimos movie theater, es el cine, que se puede llamar así, movie theater, o también cinema. Entonces, sí, es el, el lugar ese donde vamos a ver una película, right? Hello, girls. How are you doing? Todavía no terminó. Es que yo nunca visitaba un museo. Oh, really? No sé okay. So, what rules do you have? ¿Qué rules tienen hasta este momento? Ahorita pudimos don't take pictures. Don't touch, queremos decir la vitrina, pero me la traduce como Windows. Eh, mm. Sí, quizás podemos y hacerlo de forma... Linda. De forma general podríamos llamarlo el arte, the art. Don't touch the art. Mm. Uh -huh. Ok. And the next Don't one is... In the, dentro del museo. Don't eat in the museum. Don't eat in the... 
Ajá. Las okay. positivas es que estamos ahí de que take care of the museum. Take care of the okay. art. Again, podríamos utilizar nuevamente arte. Take care of the art. Ajá. Or este, of the... Take care of, of the... Este, quiero decir el patrimonio. Que no sé cómo se pronuncia. Heritage. Oh, heritage. 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 Yes. Okay. Okay. Bueno, creo que con... Okay. So I'll see you in just a moment. Hello, Noemi and Mauricio. Hello, teacher. Good How are you doing? How are you? I'm fine. Excellent. Eh, no sé de qué están tratando ahorita. Okay, so we are making rules for the different places. We have um, the zoo, the school, the movie theater, and some others. Which one is yours, Mauricio? No sé, Mauricio, con cuál estamos trabajando? The park. The park, ok. Entonces, park. En, el, en este caso están haciendo reglas para el comportamiento the dentro park. del yes. parque, Noemí. Deben hacer tres oh. afirmativas y tres negativas. No sé cómo vamos con eso, Mauricio. How are you doing? Ok. Yes, I got... I... Um, quiero ver cómo se dice guardar. Okay. Um, keep. No sé cómo se dice votar, pero in the park. In the park. Hola. Yes, mami, tell me. Eh, ¿Serían Negative. a futuro o como que están sucediendo? Sería utilizando el presente como los imperatives. Rules. Rules in the park. Yes. So, Mauricio, do you have any examples? Uh, entonces, bueno, para, para mí. Repeat, please, Mauricio. In the, eh, in the park, Luciano Hernández, no smoking. Es así, no fumar. Mm, yes, you can say don't smoke. Don't smoke. Don't, don't smoke. Mm -hmm. Don't smoke okay. in the park. Don't smoke in the park. Yes. Ay, son cortas. Entonces... Así son directas las reglas. Yeah, exactly. En la estructura, teacher, eh, va... Eh, e iniciamos con el verbo en infinitivo el sin verbo. el tú, como en los ejemplos que uh -huh. veíamos ayer en la conversación. Take okay. one pill every night. Take one pill every night. Tómese una ah. pastilla cada noche, right? Or uh, in the okay. negative, we say, don't throw trash. No tire basura. Don't throw trash. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Don't throw trash. Yes. Okay. Or Otra do not. Sería... Yeah, exactly. Right? Or you can use do not. Do not take pictures. Do not, do not take pictures. Uh -huh. Okay, so we are getting back to the main session in just 30 seconds. Have another do not carry weapon. Um, okay. do, Sorry, not, do not sleep in the chair. <laughs> do not sleep in the chair, okay. 
Maybe. Puede ser. <laughs> yeah, right. No sé qué puede pasar. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. All right, welcome back. So let's see, did you complete all the sentences, all the rules? Yes, it yes, yes, we don't. yes, okay, pretty good. So now let's hear about them. The first place we had is the zoo. So who worked with the zoo? Uh, Jose Arturo, Carla, and me. Okay. Can you present your rules, please? Okay, I I read the first. <coughs> I first. Okay. And, and one and two. All right. And number one in a post in a negative. Do not feel the animals. And do not smoke. Okay. Um here. Of negative uh, is don't use your flash camera, camera and first of positive, positive, be careful with your kids. Uh, second positive, stay away from animal K. And can you feel the dog turtle? Okay, pretty good. So excellent. Thank you very much, Carla, Jasmine, and okay. Arturo. Okay. okay, now the next place is the school. Let's see who's presenting that one. School and me. Okay, so please go ahead. A negative, don't know what in, in the school. Okay. Don't not speak in the classroom. You don't, don't not use cell phones in the classroom. Very good. And the affirmative one? Positive. Pay attention, please. Do the homework. Put the trash in the garbage. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much, Laura and Roberto. Yes, that's all. Okay, <laughs> very good. Next one is the movie theater. Let's see, that was Lorena and... Uh, oh, who was working with Lorena? Let's see. Was... Yes, I think it was Karen. So, Karen, can you present, please? No, I I was with Nestor. Oh, you were with the park. Okay. So. Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't know who was working with with Lorena. Lorena doesn't have a microphone today, so she cannot present. Es que yo, yo me uní con Lorena porque me salí y cuando me volví a entrar, mm -hmm. me quedé en el grupo de Lorena, pero, pero oh. trabajé con Néstor. Ajá. Ok. All right. So that's fine. Then, um, Néstor and Karen, can you present yours, please? Um, ok. Uh, three negatives uh, in, on the park. Um, yes. Do not carry weapon. Uh, este, um, uh, don't hold the garbage and don't do not throw in the garbage. Okay, pretty good, Nestor. Is that uh, all? And the positive. Mm -hmm. uh, And positive, yeah. uh, camping, you uh, 
you can camping here or you can room um eh, otra negativa eh, otra positiva eh, solo con dos me quedé positivo okay all right that's fine thank you very much nestor mauricio and karen excellent okay let's see who's I missing and no me okay very good great job let's see we have now laura okay Oh, Laura, you already presented together with Roberto, right? Yeah. So we are missing Selenia. Let's see, Selenia. Um, with me. And, and Ana Ruth. Okay, pretty good. So Ana Ruth, mm -hmm. go ahead, please. Um, imperative negative. Don't take picture in this place. Don't touch the art. Don't eat in the museum. And the affirmative, take care of the art. Take care of the heritage. Um, keep this place clean. Okay, excellent, Ana Ruth. Thank you for sharing. Very good, Selenia and Ana Ruth. Okay, um, are we missing anybody? Let's see, Carla? Carla Hissel? Hola. Hi, what place were you working with? Cine, con Lore. Oh, the cinema or the movie theater, okay. Tell us about the things that we have mm -hmm. to do or don't have to do at the movie theater. And negative, uh, don't use your cell phone, um, don't smoke, um, affirmative, keep, or keep silent or be quiet and enjoy the movie all right great and job excellent carla and lorena very good okay do you have any questions about the imperatives anybody no questions no questions okay all right excellent so let's continue so let me tell you about today's lesson objective. So by the end of this class, you will learn vocabulary for stores and other places and discuss where you can get different things. Vamos a hablar ahora un poquito acerca de las tiendas y otros lugares donde podemos obtener distintas cosas. So if you have watched the video, you have seen all of these places. So first we have the drugstore. What can we get at the drugstore? ¿Qué podemos encontrar en una drugstore? Okay, yeah, it's like a pharmacy. Medicine. We can aspirin. find medicine, aspirin. Antiacid. Very good. So we can find different kinds of medications, right? At the drugstore, we get different kinds of medication. And now about the supermarket. Tell me, what can we get at the supermarket? Oh, meal, drink. Okay. Use. Use. Uh, use. Food. Different kinds of food, definitely. Some snacks. Some vegetables, fruits, snacks, snacks. Okay, pretty good. Now tell me about the bookstore. What can we get there? Books. Books. <laughs> books. books. Okay. Um, what else? Idiot. We I'll can also books. get some school supplies, right? Like pencils, rulers, erasers. School. Stuff like School. that. Good. Magazines. Magazines. Okay. Exactly. 
Okay. okay. And and how about at the gas station? What can we get? Gasoline. Yeah. Gasoline, <laughs> right? Any other thing that we can get there? Hot <laughs> dogs. Oh, yeah. oil. Hot dogs. <laughs> yes, water oils. <laughs> Not sure. Sure. Okay. Sure. Pretty good. And at the restaurant, what can we get? Pupusas. Chicken. Vegetables. Turkey. Vegetables. Okay. Wine. Pan Wine. Wine. Sandwiches. Okay, so, very good. We can find some different kinds of foods in beverages or drinks, right? And now let's talk a little bit about the post office. What can we get at the post office? Stamps. Letter. Stamps. Letters. You can leave the letters. Uh -huh. Okay, you can send the letters. letters. Maps, maybe. What is it? Maps, maybe. Maps, what do you mean? Sorry, Mapa. Map. Mapas. Oh, maps. Okay. Yes. Maps. Sure. We can get some maps. All right. We can also send packages. We can get stamps. Pretty good. And then there's also we can send mail. Podemos mandar correo, right? Mail. Tenemos la palabra para correo electrónico. Email. Esa es sería de electrónico, verdad? Email. Y para el correo normal, el correo común es mail. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mail. Next one we have is the department store. What can we get there? Clothes. 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 Shoes. Shorts. Can get pants. shoes. Mm. Okay. Dresses. 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 Mm -hmm. Socks. 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 Mm. Okay. And yes. Exactly. Hats. So the department Jacket. store is a big store where we find different areas or different departments, right? We can find women's clothes or women's shoes, men's shoes, and men's clothes. We can also um, find some electronics uh, and some other things, uh, right? Tell me. Right. Right. Okay, the last one we have is the bank. What can we do at the bank? Money. money. Get some money, right? Credit cards. Yes, you can get some money, you money. can get some credit cards. Any orders. Okay. Debit card. You can also get debit cards. Okay, pay, so um, pay bills. you can pay bills, definitely. Pay you bills. can also make a deposit. Hacer depósitos en el banco, make a Red deposit. Mess. Or you can also cash a check. Cambiar Agar cheque. recibos, teacher. Pay bills. You can pay, pay bills. bills. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Pay so bills. Those are those are some things that you can do at the bank. All right, pretty good. So now tell me about some other places that we may mm -hmm. add. Even dinero, in, ¿cómo sería? Um, get a loan. Hacer un préstamo. Get a loan. Get a loan. Get a loan. Mm -hmm. Get a loan. Yes. ¿Cómo se Seguros de vida. Um, that would be, let's see, how do you say seguro de vida? Um, hmm, I forgot. Let me just check it. Life insurance. Yes, life insurance. Life insurance. There you are. Hipoteca, teacher. Hipoteca. That is, I have it in the tip of my tongue. 
Let's see. What's going on with you, teacher? No, let me. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm. Okay, so maybe Hipoteca is mortgage. Hipoteca Mor would Mor be mortgage. Mortgage. Yes, mortgage. Mortgage. Mm -hmm. Tra hacer transferencias, ¿cómo se dice? Make a transfer. Make transfer. Mm -hmm. Or a tra transfer. Mm -hmm. Transfer. Yes. Okay. Thank you. So now let's talk about some other places. A ver, ¿qué otros lugares podemos agregar acá? Um, could be in Spanish or in English, and then we add them, okay? Charge. Hospital. The hospital. Yes. Hospital. Any other? Charge. The church. La iglesia. Church. 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 Mm -hmm. Sorry, what is it? The school. Uh, Buffet de abogados, como se dice? Wow. A lawyers. Buffet. Lawyers. Lawyers office. Lawyers. Uh -huh. lawyers. Okay. Jail. Mm -hmm. Um, what is it? Sorry. Carcel. Jail. Jail. Yes. Uh, uh, uh. Puesto policial. Police station. Police office. Police station. Yes. Police station. Yes. Contents office. Thanks. What is it? Perdón, de repente escucho entrecortado, entonces no les comprendo. Bien, sorry. Um, can you Accountant's repeat? office. Accountant's office. B. Sure. Beach. Hotel. Uh, beach. Sure. Hotel. Hotel. Yes. Hotel. Any other? How about the city hall or the town hall? Police department. Cinema. Cinema or movie theater? Mall. Mall. A mall. Oh, I see. Any others? Town hall. So we plan. Yes, the town the hall or city hall sería yes. alcaldía, okay? Yes. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. Right. Then, sorry, what's that? Gym. <laughs> the gym. Yes, for the fitness people. <laughs> ah, totally. <laughs> Any other places to add? Bake schools. The school. Bakeries. Bakery. Play, Bake. play hmm. games. Tienen tienda y tienen juegos. Lake. The lake. Sure. Lake. Mountains. <laughs> Mountains. Sure. Let's see. Okay. So now it's time to repeat. Please say drugstore. 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 Supermarket. Supermarket. Bookstore. 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 Gas station. Gas station. Restaurant. Restaurant. Post office. Department store. Department store. Department store. Bank. 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 Hospital. Hospital. Church. Church. Lawyer's office. 
Lawyer's office. Lawyer's office. Jail. 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 Police station. Police station. Accountant's office. Accountant's office. Station. Beach. Beach. Office. Hotel. 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 City Hall. Hotel. City Hall. City Hall. City Hall. Town City Hall. Hall. Town Hall. Town Hall. Cinema. Town Hall. Cinema. Cinema. Movie theater. Movie theater. Movie theater. Mall. 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 Gym. 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 School, school, bakery, baker, bakery, bakery, lake, 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 mountains, mountains, mountains. Okay, so now we are going to play a game where we have to guess the place. So I am going to read a description of the different places, and then you have to guess what place we're talking about. So let's give it a try. Here, I'm going to tell you the things that you can do in this place, and then you tell me what place we're talking about. Let's see. The first one, this is the place where you deposit, withdraw money, or cash a check. What place bank. is it? The bank. bank. Exactly. Bank. Pretty good. Okay, next one. This is the place where you go when you are going to travel by plane. Airport. The airport. Exactly. Next one. This is where you can buy bread and cakes. Bakery. 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 The bakery. Restaurant. The bakery. Okay, next one. It's a place where you can get drinks, especially alcoholic drinks, and sometimes food. Supermarket. Okay, it could be a restaurant. Or we also have the... What's the place where you go for alcoholic drinks? Bar. Bar. <laughs> bar. <laughs> yes. A bar or a pub. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Next one is, let's see. This is a place where you can buy books and magazines. Books or books or Okay. The library. Next one. To travel by bus, you go to the? Bus station. Bus station. Very good. Bus station. Okay. Let me see. Our religious place of Christian worship. Church. The church. church. Excellent. And the place where you can see movies. Cinema. 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 That is a cinema the or the movie theater. theater. Exactly. A cinema. Okay. How about the place where you go when you want to cut your hair? Mm -hmm. uh, when you want to barber shop. Barber shop and beauty shop. Okay. Mm. Barber shop or yeah, beauty salon. Beauty we can salon. also call it a hairdresser's. Or a hair salon. Okay. House. Oh, really? You have one? That's nice. Okay. And let's see one last yeah, one. Thing. This is a place where you can buy or borrow books. Library. Yes. Library. It's a library. Exactly. Okay. Pretty good. All right. So now let's continue. 
Well, we have a second lesson objective that would be by the end of this class, you will learn prepositions of place in order to give directions. Additionally, you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. So we are going to start with a conversation. And um, let me read it. It goes like, excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restroom. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main and First Avenue. On the corner of Main and First? Yes, it's across from the park. You can't miss it. Thanks a lot. Okay, so please look at the conversation and tell me if you have any questions about the vocabulary or the pronunciation of any words. Mm -hmm. mm. No questions? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, excellent. No. So now it's time to practice the conversation. Let's see, do we have any volunteers to read the conversation? Mauricio. Me. Mauricio and, Karen. and Karen. Okay, so Mauricio, you start. Okay, excuse me, can you help me? Is the public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry, I don't I don't think so. Oh oh no, my my son needs a restroom. Well, there is a restroom in the department store on Main Street. We're on the main street. It's on the corner of Main and First Avenue. On the corner of of Main and First? Yes, it's across from the park and you can't miss it. Thanks a lot. All right, excellent. Thank you very much, Mauricio and Karen. Okay, do we have a second part to read the conversation? Me. Me. Roberto and... Me. Who was that? Noemi. Okay, Roberto, you can start now. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restroom. Well, there is room, there is a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on, on Main Street? It's on the corner of, of Main and First Avenue. Oh, the corner of Main and First? Yes, it's across from the park. You can meet it. Thanks a lot. Excellent, Roberto and Noemi, thank you. Okay. We have just one minute for hearing another pair to read the conversation. Let's see who's going to read. Me. That is Arturo. Just me. And, sí. and Jasmine. Okay, Arturo, start please. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh, no, my son needs a restroom. Well, there is a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main and First Avenue. On the corner? of Main and First. Yes, it's across from the park. You can miss it. Thanks a lot. 
Okay, very good. Thank you, Arturo and Jasmine. All right, so please repeat. Restroom. Restroom. Rest Rest I don't think so. I don't, I don't think, think so. so. Okay, department store. Department, department, department store. store. Main Street. Main Street. Main Street. Main Street. Main Street. First Avenue. First Avenue. First Avenue. 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 Main. 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 First. 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 Across from. Across, Across from. from. You can't miss it. You can't miss it. You can and miss it. You can miss it. Can miss you. Okay. You can miss it. Very good. So thanks for your attention. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Take care and have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye, everybody. Take care. Good night for everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody.